So today we're just making an easy chicken salad. I'm going away so I don't want to eat anything too heavy and I really want to get my protein in. So what I'm doing is just removing all the fat from the chicken and putting it on a separate plate and leaving it in quite big chunks because we're going to be slow cooking it and if you cut it up too small it will dry out. So now our chicken is prepared. I'm just putting my Himalayan salt, some pepper and some olive oil on my chicken. Okay, so now I've just got my little crock pot and I've had it sitting on the heat for a little while so it's nice and hot. So then when we add our chicken in, we just sear it on each side and get that nice bit of brown colouring in the bottom of the dish, which adds to the flavour later. Next, I dice up a whole leek. Um, I just remove the outside layer, give it a nice wash to make sure there's no dirt and add it to our crock pot. The olive oil butter is optional, but I do find it gives it a nice taste, so I only add a little bit. And next I add one chicken stock cube, just mixed with water, and this will stop the leek from burning on the bottom and bring up those little brown bits and just create more flavour. And I also add one minced garlic clove. Okay, so I have some fresh herbs from out of the garden. I just add about one tablespoon of diced up sage and one tablespoon of fresh thyme, or a little bit more or less, depending on what you like. And then I just add the rind of one whole lemon. I also dice up some fresh chives, just a small handful, just to add some extra flavour. If you notice it starts to get a bit dry, just add one cup of vegeta mixed with water and also add some salt and pepper. Okay, so now we just add our chicken back into our crock pot and put the oven back down to low and cook it for about one hour and it'll be nice and cooked and juicy. Okay, so my sweet potato that I put in the oven earlier has been cooked. So what I do is just remove the skin from the sweet potato and then I mash it up and add some cinnamon. I also added a teaspoon of stevia, which I didn't actually record because I didn't know if it was going to taste good, but it actually tastes hectic. Like when I mix it with the salad, it tastes really good. So add one teaspoon of stevia as well.
Okay, so I just have some washed lettuce leaves. I've got baby spinach, rocket, and just some lettuce. And what I've done, I've washed it and dried it really well. And then I just add olive oil, balsamic vinegar, dried up basil, and salt and pepper. Also, if you have pine nuts, if you just toast them lightly and add them, they would have gone really well in your salad too. But everything combined tastes really well together. I was actually surprised because I just sort of chucked everything together. But yep, I'm really happy with this salad. So please remember to like my video on YouTube if you liked it. And thanks for watching.